guys if you're new to my channel just click the subscribe button click that little ring ding dong bell send me the notifications save that stay tuned for more videos enjoy the content what's going on youtube it is your boy dd kills and yep today we're doing something a bit different first of all our face cam up there is going to be completely different i'm actually wearing a hat for once this one's actually sent by youtube so thanks youtube for that really cool gift that one is don't really wear snapbacks mainly but i thought i'd try it out on a video and looking at it it's not that bad you know snapback ain't that bad if it was in black i think snapbacks would suit me i have to think about that one anyway what we're going to be talking about is call of duty 2017 and what we expect and what we know and a wish list great <laughs> so what we're going to start off is what we know um I would put up screenshots, but I don't know if I'll get in trouble for posting screenshots or not, so I'll keep it clean, legit. So first off, what we know so far is that 100% it is boots on the ground, and I know a lot of you would probably already know that, and I'm only updating it now, because I'd rather do it when the hype's kind of died down so we can try to get the hype back up. So yeah. Oh, before I say the other part. I just want you guys to know this gameplay I did not die once throughout the whole game I joined late as you saw but I didn't die once so you gotta watch that it's mad anyway so 100% of the spooks on the ground we know that cause Michael Condry and this other guy that's uh, Sledgehammer made a few funny tweets banter tweets saying oh look I found your boots on the ground and the locker country and all of that stuff so it is confirmed boots on the ground they also reconfirmed it and Activision also said it that they're gonna go back to their roots because uh, obviously Infinite Warfare didn't sell and a lot of YouTubers aren't even making gameplay of Infinite Warfare that's how bad it was so yeah that, that that's out of the equation right? that's out uh, that's really all we know and now in terms of speculations I reckon it's gonna be a Vietnam era, which means there's gonna be old guns. The reason why I think that, <sighs> stupid motorbike. The reason why I think that is because Advanced Warfare, even now it's getting a little bit of support, they're adding in supply drop guns, and the guns that they're adding in is um, the old guns, like uh, I think it was M1 Iron or something, Grand? I, I can't remember. But all the guns that they're adding in is like a really, really old ones. And Black Ops 3, they've started to add old guns, the M16, uh, PPSH. Uh, so I reckon they're going back to old school type of games and guns. So that's what I think of it. And if that's the case, wicked. I like the old guns. I like the old setting. That's another thing. They confirmed that the setting with Infinite Warfare was something that they had put their hands up to. They flopped it. So they're actually going back to the settings that we all like, which was either modern or Vietnam or or someone COD 5 World at War 1 so we're gonna hopefully see a transition there now what I want to happen is obviously we've got boots in the ground but I want good kill streaks like all the kill streaks that we've had in advanced warfare I didn't like them Black Ops 3 the best they were good you know they were good I can't deny that infinite warfare they are rubbish they are so bad 1300 school 1600 school something like that for an apex thing which is just a robot um, and Black Ops 3, a Wraith was so OP, and I said I was only like 1100 points. Where's the logic? So, yeah, the school streets were so underpowered, and because it's Sledgehammer, I don't want no laser guns. I really hate the laser guns, it's like all these Star Wars stun effects, and I don't like it. I don't want none of that. That really, really sucks. And yes, we just got the chopper gunner. Anyway, please no laser guns i don't mind like futuristic um equipment like a claymore that i don't know freaking i don't even know a claymore that explodes with paintballs or something i don't even know man. i'm just saying something out of random but please i beg of you give us something good right we want look at this the chopper gunner was such a good kill streak we haven't had a chopper gunner since black ops 1 and that chopper gunner was all right but they had a gunship as well which is literally the chopper gunner what happened to those kill streaks? They were OP, they were good, they were fun. Right? We want medium to small size map. We don't know we don't want no extra large maps. Right? We want a free lane map as well. Look at Ghost. 
the, all those maps were so massive that no one played it and everyone just played Strike Zone. That's why they implemented the Strike Zone so people would actually play the game. They shot that match up, but what assholes. I'm on a 16 kill streak there, I think, or 16. But we want nice, nice maps. Right? Have your snow maps, have your rain maps. Obviously, every Call of Duty has that. Please. This guy just got a triple with his intervention. Give us good maps. Pray. We just want that. We want good equipments. We don't want no futuristic bullshit equipments. That's what I was meant to say. Normal Semtex, normal grenades, normal stuns, claymores, C4, wicked. How nice and standard simplicity was that? We want pro perks. Pro perks were the thing. I actually commented on the Chaos X Silence's video saying pro perks is a must. I got over 400 likes. Like, doesn't that say something? Pro perks needs to come back. We want good weapon attachments. There's so much. Look at Modern Warfare 2, how successful that was. Black Ops 1, how successful. Why? Simple. Good guns, good maps, good kill streaks, pro perks. Is it that hard to do that? I don't understand. Really, hey. But anyway, I was trying to get the nuke on this, and because the game actually ran out of the time I was going down, I never got the nuke. I think I was at four or five kills off, but I didn't die throughout the whole game, so that's pretty cool. But anyway, guys, uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and hopefully something different. 2017, let's go.